Oh no, welcome to Missing People's Psychic Readings. I'm Margaret. If you like describing picture for myself, you want. Now, before I start today, I'm just going to put out there I do have dyslexia, so I might get um, names and places wrong. It's part of my dyslexia. It's who I am. I can't do much about it. Sorry. Yeah. So, this is Tao Chod, obviously, I'm going to get his name wrong. Um, he was 18 when he went missing. So, what happened to him? I think it's Beldra, where he was from, the country Beldra. And I think it was in 2018, late 2018, he came down to Australia, okay? He was staying in New South Wales, in so fucking backpacker's place. I could be wrong there. Um, and he was at a, um, a bar. This was the last place he was seen. Um, it was May the 31st, 2019, okay? Um, and so the backpackers place for discern about it. So they reported this to the police, okay? Um, and I think it was May, June the 6th, um, a couple of days later, um, the parents contacted the police because it was unusual that he didn't get contact their family because it's not like he's a regular contact person but what they found um all his belongings like personal belongings were still in his room where he was staying so therefore that was quite hard okay so i'm gonna do a reading on him so feel free to move on if you don't want to watch it okay two um if you have any information on him please pass it on to the police okay um you can ring out comp stoppers if you want to, if you want to. Um, thirdly, some of my information might be more a proof thing. Um, does this make sense to the family? Um, and same with the names. It might not be connected to the case itself. Fourthly, I don't want to hear that I'm right or wrong until the case is closed. Or you're 100% sure, okay? Fourthly, I just want useful information down the bottom, okay? Um, yeah, okay. So, like I said, I'm going to do a reading on him. Feel free to move on if you don't want to watch it, okay? So, first thing, I'm ending fair play straight away, okay? Um, I'm getting drugs related. Um, again, f family farm something like that family farm i get in um now i'm gonna white big building it's not a house it's a building and across the road from that there's a cow fan park that's important i don't know how but that's important and then at the same time i'm getting up the beach uh, there's a beach beach sorry river bridge okay now there's black rocks around this beach and there's a, a sign um like a name or something something's important around there and one again um you have to get a metal detector and go around the bridge itself okay this is that's important and this is near where near this cafe place that he was last seen okay um last circuit um now i'm getting a guy called martin okay his name's martin he's got black hair he's quite thin five foot six into yeah in five foot six five foot nine um what else did i get um he's in his 30s um I feel like it's hanging around this white brick building, whatever it is. It's hanging around there. Um, let's look at um, this guy. Um, I, I just got there's a tattoo on his left leg somewhere. I don't know where, but it's on his leg, left leg, right? Um, um, what else did I pick up? And again, I, I think this is more of a food thing, but I'm in a way in Neighbours, okay? Um, they're both TV shows, if you, if you haven't seen them. But again, them two, 
um, coffee shop, um, now this Martin guy, and then I, I think I did say, um, I picked up a gun pistol with him, um, but at the same time I'm hearing knife, but I don't think the knife is connected to this Martin guy, okay, um, I'm just picking up knife, but yeah, I don't know why that's important, but I'm getting, yeah, so the gun pistol is connected to Martin, but the knife's not, yeah. Um, and there's something about the wallet, um, with his wallet, um, this guy's wallet, um, I can't say his name, so, but his wallet's important, okay. Um, um, yeah, I can find help. Yeah, like I said, um, um, first, I think that's it. Um, but this guy Martin's important. Okay, I don't know who he is, but he's important. And going near this beach. No, like I said, it's, it sounds like it's near the coffee shop near this um, caravan place um, and it's a name of something that has start off something so yeah that's why I'm going to start up something so they're, they're, they're the main things that if, you, if you're looking into this case and you think oh, where do I start this is probably the part you need to start from that's what I'm getting um, what do I get with him um, Study, he's studying stuff, something. Um, this young man, I'm so sorry, so not getting his name right, but he's studying something. Um, yeah, that's um, I just can go keep on going back to the name, I'm not right. No. That's me. How many way might not be connected to the show? It might be something else, like away from home, something like that. But yeah, that's something about that word, okay? Um, um, yeah. That's pretty much it. I hope it's useful. Um, yeah, I'm not getting anything con else connected to him. Um, um, hope you guys find him and uh, yeah, see you next time for another missing person. Thumbs up if you like, subscribe if you want and see you later. Bye.